there you guys okay so um i'm actually on my way to gamestop right now i've been there's a pop that i've been looking for for a while not a while about a couple of weeks it came out back in 2019 and i've been searching a lot of gamestops to see if they'll have it and there's one that actually had it i don't know why i didn't check this gamestop before but um i kind of just looked on there earlier today and i found out that they had one available so i ordered it and i'm going there to pick it up now um i have to it's something strange that i have to do because all the stores are just now starting to open back up um but they're not at full capacity so some places are you know you can only pick up from outside you can't actually go in so that's the case right now um so i'm going there to get this pop so here we go Okay, you guys, so I left the game stop and now I just realized that I have to get some milk for my baby. So I'm going over here to Walmart and when I was parking, a lady told me that they have um, all the main doors closed. So I have to walk like all the way towards the very end, the other end of the store to get in. So, ugh. but while I'm here, I think I'm going to do, well, I really, I really don't know if I should, but I'm going to walk past the pop aisle just to see what they have. Like, I'm really just here to get milk. That's it. But I'm going to just stop and look to see what kind of pops they have. Here we go. Okay, so they don't have a big selection. They have Elsa, uh, Toy Story 4, The Bunny, some more Elsas, uh, a terrible box of Johnny uh, from Dirty Dancing. Uh, what's this down here? Water Knock, another one. Yeah, they have a terrible pop selection. They don't really have much going on. Well, wait a minute, what's this? MJ from wait a minute okay so they have MJ from Spider-Man oh, I really don't care for that one though and I think that's it okay we can go <gasps> never mind I found more okay so they have another bunny another Elsa uh, the same pretty much the same stuff they have Dirty Dancing but they have Baby from Dirty Dancing with the digital movie included uh, what's all back here just more Elsa's like man is that all they have uh, a holy molten man oh my gosh I think how much is this I don't see a price on it anywhere but I think I'm gonna have to pick this up now I just ran over to Target really quick to see what they have and it looks like they got a little bit more going on let's see what we got here got the fantastic four let's see american history uh that's ava duvernay a director oh john baskin from big let's see is there anything cool cw happy gilmore Kirby. Let's see. Oh wow, they have a really big selection. Let me see. Tiger Woods. It's pretty cool. Dark Voyager from Fortnite. Ah, Pusheen! Ah, oh, with the heart. I think I'm gonna get this one. Hold on to this one. Do we have Lily Madison? Mm -hmm. Let's see. James Bond. He's a cool looking one. The Miz. Ah! Bud Bundy. Oh, this is awesome. I think I might get him too. Oh. Bud Bundy. I think I'm making him too. I'm gonna hold on to it. <gasps> Teen Wolf. Scott Howard. So which one is this from? Is this from the? Is this the the one with um? What you call in it? Um, uh, Michael Fox. Michael J. Fox. I don't know. It looks like it. It might be. From Big Daddy, Scuba Sam. Yeah, they got a lot of the two packs up here. They got Han Solo and Princess Leia, The Wanderer and Hartick, Modern Family. 
Cam and Mitch. I like that one. Oh, Fred Weasley from Harry Potter. Michelle from The Walking Dead. Fantastic Four. So they got some pretty good ones here. I mean, none that like stick out to me. But uh, okay, cool. And at the t and, and at the top, you guys, they also have a lot of the ten inch figures. Um, there's Jack Jack. Yeah, but that's all they seem to. They had a nice section. It was cool. All right, so I think, I think I'm gonna go. <gasps> no freaking way. Ah. Oh. Turned. Okay, you guys. So it's actually the next day. Um, after I left the store, I came home. I cooked, took care of the baby, and kind of got sidetracked. But we are back, so I want to show you guys what um, I picked up yesterday. So first, um, I went to GameStop and I purchased the freaking pop that I've been looking for for a while. I'm so happy that I got it. It is the Pop Ad Icons Mr. Owl. And here he is. This is number 62 in that line. And I'm, this is actually like one of my favorite ones because man, this just screams nostalgia to me. I remember seeing the commercial when I was a kid. I don't see it too much now. Um, I think I saw it about maybe a week ago on the TV. Um, it, it was really random. And I was like, wait a minute, that's the Tissy Pop commercial? I haven't seen that forever. Um, but here it is. I'm gonna take this out the box for you guys. Real quick, cause this is kind of like the main reason for pop hunting yesterday on the first day of us being halfway open back up oh hello okay so here is the figure and i am just so blown away i'm in love with this it doesn't really look like a pop it actually just looks like an actual just shrunken down cartoon version of you know mr owl and when i say that i mean you know you have like a spongebob pop you take a spongebob pop and you look at it it doesn't look exactly like the spongebob from tv um you know it's, it's got a lot of changes in it but you can still tell it's spongebob but with this there's no changes or anything it, it looks exactly like mr owl and i think that's one of the reasons why i like it so much um if you look closely um one of the details on it i like how they made the tongue sticking out um looking the lollipop that's uh that was a great gesture to put in there i like that they did that um you can see he has the graduation hat on because he's an owl and he's smart the only thing is that with his um well it's not skin but i guess his feather color is i kind of would have made it maybe more of a cream or an off-white kind of to give it that vintage look because the commercial is so old and he's so old as far as an ad icon um but i'm not tripping about the white because i know in the commercial he's white um, but that's just the only thing i wanted to know like if they would have made a chase version or another version of him um you know with kind of like on an off-white scale but uh, i think this is amazing so here he is one of my this is like actually in my ad icon collection, I think he's gonna be like definitely in the top two. All right, throw him to the side. And the next one that I wanna show you are the two that I picked up when I went to Target. Um, this was totally a random find. I didn't really think I was gonna find this, but I was looking through some of the pops and we have a Boy Meets World. This was so random. When I saw this, I was like, is that Corey? from Boy Meets World. So I immediately had to grab it because I remember getting out of school back in middle school and coming home, changing my clothes, popping some popcorn, getting a pop and well, soda pop and going upstairs and just watching Boy Meets World for about two hours. So it was time for dinner. So here he is. Um, I'm gonna take him at the box. For now. Here's Corey. I think his last name was Feldman. Was it Corey Feldman? No, it's not Corey Feldman. That's one of those other boys whose name is that. Um, I forgot Corey's last name, but if you know, please comment down below. And there he is. Look how they made his curly hair because he's known for his curly hair in the show. I like the outfit that he's wearing too. It's so Corey. Like, I think he wore this with the blue button down shirt opened up in one of the episodes. And his head is really big. Will he stand on his own? He will. He will. So here's Corey. Um, another one part of this set is Topanga. They didn't have Topanga there, um, but I'm going to be on the lookout for her because I definitely want to complete this set like as soon as possible. And the last one was, I was super psyched about finding, was Patrick from the Spongebob movie. Uh, the new one, Sponge on the Run. Like, I know you guys probably saw in the footage, he was just sitting on top of some other figures of for Spongebob. And I was like, 
really? So I definitely grabbed him. I had to grab him. I was like, oh my gosh, yes. Because I was originally going to order it um, from, you know, second market. Uh, but, the, you know, the price was kind of high. So I'm definitely glad that I did find this one um, for the price at Target. I'm not going to open it. I'm actually going to save this because I'm going to actually do um, another review video with um, all the SpongeBob figures from this line. So just stay tuned for that. But, yeah, here we go. So that was the little mini pop hunt for today. Now that everything is starting to open back up, these were my three finds and I'm really happy. Uh, so yeah, but there you guys go. That was my video for today. Please remember to comment, like, and subscribe. Also follow me on my Instagram. It's underscore peewee for some cool pics and everything. And well, there you go. See you guys in the next one. Peace. <laughs>